Hey everybody, it's Faith from Fire Science Hero. I hope everyone is well. Oof, let me tell you. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna throw this out there for our new subscribers because so, I've had a little bit of a jump in the last few days. So I have a regular job that I work, just throwing that out there. So, and I work that job 50 plus hours a week. My days off are Tuesdays and Thursdays. I try to reserve those days for reading cards and doing the things that I need to do to be a functional member of society and an adult. I didn't do very much yesterday because four of the five days that I work are Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. And in my line of work, I have to deal with people. And being an empath, dealing with people is not the easiest thing in the world to do because I'm a, I'm a sponge. Yeah. <laughs> so whatever energy it is, positive or negative, I'm absorbing it. And it's not always the most positive of energy. So by the time I get home on a Monday night, I literally just want to throw on a pair of yoga pants and put my hair up in a messy bun and put on a nice comfy sweater and drink chai tea and just not deal with anybody for a day. But anyway, that's why I didn't get any reading done because yesterday I, I cleaned my house and I vegged. That's it's like, <laughs> I need a messy bun day. Anyway back to it. This reading will be for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for May 2021. My Sagittarius friends, if this resonates with you, cool. It's your free will too, but if you choose to do with the message given to you by the cards, if you choose to do anything at all, it's your journey, not mine. I'm just throwing down cards. If it doesn't resonate, that's okay too. You can check your Moon, Rising, your Venus sign readings if you think you might want something that may resonate a little bit better. Just keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid and all things can and maybe vice versa. might even play out from the perspective of a cross-watcher. And our difference, the cross-watchers are always welcome here at the Fireside Tarot Table. Everybody's always welcome here. I love it when people stop by. Thank you for stopping by and taking time out of your day to throw down some cards with me. So, um, two things before I uh, do the invocation on the cards and throw them down for you, Sagittarius. One, never, ever make any life-altering decisions based on a tarot reading. It's just not a good idea. I mean, I'm here to have a good time. If it resonates, cool. If it doesn't, mm, don't think before you leap, okay? Two, if it's not your reading, not your story, I lost my train of thought for a second there. If it's not your reading, not your story, not your message, leave the cards on the table and walk away. And it's not always going to resonate with everybody because these are general readings. Okay. Alrighty. I had to find my fire sign deck. All right. I'm going to get these out of the way. Uh, whoop, 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 whoop. All right, and at the end of the last Zodiac set, I reset these, so they're in order, so I gotta shuffle them a little bit extra long of a time. Okay, Heavenly Father, Mother of Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides and Archangels, I ask for any messages you have for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, for May 2021. Bring Sagittarius to their highest possible spiritual good and put them on their highest possible spiritual path. Thanks for coming down and hanging out with us today. Let's throw them down for Sagittarius. May saying stop shuffling. I gotta do, hold on. Like I said, I straightened it, I reset it, which resetting a deck is putting the cards in order. Okay. One more. The Chromebook's doing that thing where it cleans again. 
Stop it. Stop it. Thank you. Okay. All right, one more. Oh, why are you here, Sagittarius? Ten of Swords. Oof. Here's the good news. It's over. It's over. This is a painful cycle coming to an end. This is Ten Swords. That hurt. That's probably the bad news. It hurt. But the sun's going to shine again. So you're through the worst of it. That's that's not a bad thing. Probably sucked in the moment. It's not going to suck anymore. It's just not. You might still be hanging out in the moment, but... All right. Strength in the past, card of Leo. Talks about the polarities and the differences in a relationship. It can also talk about trust. Possibly a little bit of holding back. The lovers. Oh, wow. Card of Gemini. If it's setting off alarms in your brain, cool. If it's not, that's fine, too. Soulmate connection. Wow, two or three majors. Okay. Can speak of a choice. Hmm. All right. Angels bringing two lovers together. Here and now, the fool. Three out of four majors. Oh boy. Fool card. This is your now. Sagittarius. New things, new places, new people, new ideas, new paths, new journeys. Jumping. Sagittarius, you jumping into something? Super proud of you. Just look before you leap for crying out loud. Okay. What's coming in? The Queen of Cups and the Ace of Pentacles. Well. Are you jumping toward a new cup? Are you jumping toward a new offer of abundance? That's not bad. Oh, what am I doing? I'm not even done with this yet. What am I doing? All right, let's take off the bottom. The tower reversed. Sagittarius. Are you rebuilding a tower with an old cycle? An old painful cycle? I'm not going to tell you how to live. That's not why I'm here. But you know that's not the most brilliant of ideas. throw clarifiers on that because this could split the story friends some of you are trying to rebuild on something old some of you may be building the tower the way you want it built which isn't bad Let's see what the clarifiers say here in a minute my coffee gets in the I have to like do something with this table because my coffee gets in the way <laughs> I have to figure this out we're still in the process of redoing the studio, so uh, I'm not going to lie. The backdrop covers up a lot of empty box, or not empty boxes, but boxes and crazy space at this point. Eight of Swords. 
on top of strengths. It's got you all up in your head. Somebody's in a mental cage. <clears throat> Or was. This is the past. I don't think your legs are tied together. And I don't think you're tied to the chair. Your eyes are blindfolded. Your arms are bound. But you could probably get up out of that chair and walk out of it anytime you want to. And I'm wondering if maybe you did. Again, we'll see what the clarifiers have to say. Something to do with a connection where you trusted someone. There was differences in the relationship. Gemini. Five of Cups. connection where there was a choice that led to a five of cups moment. Guess what? Only three of those cups got... Really? Pardon me a second. Sorry about that. I sent the domestic partner out after cat food so I could do this and we're not going there. Anyway, only three of the five cups are spilled. There's Still two full cups here. So something went south in a relationship where there was a choice. There's a blessing there. Again, we'll get clarity in a minute. Hmm. One of this full. Five of swords. Hmm. Doing what's best for you? Standing up and saying enough's enough? Not caring if people walk away angry at this point? Because you're jumping? Hmm. Huh. Okay. Why is the Queen of Cups here? Page of Pentacles. There's the Pentacle. So, somebody may be coming in with a cup and a Pentacle. Hmm. Could be an Earth sign. Could be a Water sign. Doesn't necessarily have to be. It's the energy coming off of it. It's a deep emotion. Page of Pentacles can represent an apology can also represent an offer, a small, slow-moving offer. That's not bad. Why is the Ace of Pentacles here? Two of Swords. Oh. Oh. Oh, my. Oh, saggy, saggy, saggy. Oh, saggy, saggy, saggy. My friends. Why are you going to have a Two of Swords moment over, over a Pentacle? Two of Swords speaks of a decision. One that's a best not to go into blindly. At least it's in the upright. So it's not necessarily an impossible decision. It's just one of those decisions where no matter what you do, somebody's going to get hurt. Hmm. 
All right, let's throw some clarifiers down. Universe, Source, and Spirit, can I get some clarity in the cards on the table for Sagittarius, May 2021? Oh, hi. Death and the Wheel of Fortune reversed. Okay. This is transformation. Ending of old cycles, beginning of new ones. That's really what death is, right? Old cycle ending, new cycle beginning. Okay. This is what I was afraid of. Karmic connections, unfinished business, the wheel of the year reversed, wheel of fortune reversed. Same card, different deck. The cycle's over, Sagittarius. The sun's gonna shine, Sagittarius. They came out together, they should be over here. Somebody not letting a cycle end. Maybe the person on the other side of the situation isn't letting the cycle end. Six of Swords reversed. Talk on it. I, this isn't you. This isn't you. This is them. This is the person on the other side of the situation. Sun's coming up in your life. See, is there a retrograde coming? Because this is like the third one in a row where stuff's coming back that shouldn't be coming back. I mean... I'm going to have to check my calendar because I'm, what's up with that? I don't get it. Why is strength here? <clears throat> Two of Pentacles in the reverse. Why? Unlevel, unstable, not wanting change to occur. Polarities and differences in a relationship, not wanting change to occur. The Fool, reversed. 
Somebody don't want somebody to jump. Somebody doesn't want something to change. Why is there swords here? Star. It's a card of healing. Positive energy. Things flowing the way they should be flowing. Why? Nine of Cups reversed. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. I don't like it at all. I don't know what they put you through, but they put you through some kind of mental ringer. I wasn't there. I'm just throwing down cards. I didn't see anything. But whoever this is for, oh gosh. This is someone you trusted. And they locked you in a cage of self-doubt. And every time you tried to heal from it, they'd put your... They'd fill your cups with negative things. Wow. Gosh, I'd walk away too. I would. I would walk away. Something tells me they just keep trying to do it. Wow, okay. Why is the lovers here? Why is the lovers here? Hi. King of Wands reversed. Why? Page of Wands reversed. Loss of passion, no forward movement, no communication. Something came in for you. Just didn't work out. At least not the way you wanted it to, I don't think. It did something to you because it caused this transformation. And it caused a painful cycle to come to an end. Wow. Wow. Why the Five of Cups? Four of Pentacles. Sad because you're still holding on. Why? Seven of Wands reversed. Out of control. Things are still out of control. Still holding on. Maybe someone's still holding on because they couldn't control the situation. Maybe you are. I don't know. Let's not talk about that. I'm done with the past. Let's move forward here. The here and the now. Why is the fool here? 
Oh, I love it when answers come out like that. Hi. This is Swords Reversed. No communication, you moved on. Oh, wow. Okay, well, I'd move on too, I guess. If somebody stopped talking to me, I would say, okay, bye. Hmm. Totally a Sagittarius thing. If we get ignored long enough, deuces. Knight of Pentacles. The Pentacles thing going on here. There's the Pentacles thing. See the theme here? I'll just take my just take my awesome pentacle elsewhere or I'll take this off awesome pentacle being offered to me. Somebody else will want it. Why is five swords here? Why is five swords here? King Cups. Why? Confusion. Okay, I'll bite one more. You know, I'm trying to keep these short and sweet and to the point, but being real vague. It's possibly be less vague. Thanks. The moon. Okay. Not supposed to know. Thank you. Mm. Not supposed to know why. Not supposed to question it. You're just supposed to do it. Mm. Could have something to do with this new moon coming up or the next full moon. Could have something to do with the Pisces. Doesn't necessarily have to. I got a lot of water here, but I got some air and some earth and some fire too. So. You're standing up, doing what you want to do. Somebody's offer isn't good enough, their offer isn't good enough. They can leave. You want what you want. This King of Cups, he's got a lot of love to give, but he's not going to give it to just anybody. I think the queen is coming in. But I think some of you may be tempted to head down that smoky trail again. Why is the Queen of Cups here? Why the Queen of Cups? She came out in the reverse, but she came out. There may be some hesitation in returning that cup one more two of wands because there's something you have to let go of to move forward and I think it's what's going on over here. You got to let go of that which does not want to let you go. And you have to let go of what you don't want to let go of, what you're still holding on to. 
Sagittarius, I know it's hard, but you got to let go. I can say this because I am one. A little bit of control freaks. Just just a little. We got to be the ones in charge. Just just a little. I, and I can say that. I'm not bashing. I am a Sagittarius. And I will be the first one to admit that I'm just a little bit of a control freak. <laughs> Especially when I don't get my way. It's something I'm transcending about myself. Because it's not one of my better aspects. You gotta let somebody else take the reins once in a while. You gotta get a handle on your own. Not try to have a handle on somebody else. Why is the page of pentacles here? more hesitation and the only one who's going to end this is you hear me say it again the sun will shine again but you have to be willing to let it you have to let it go you know the you know the fastest way to make history repeat itself When you don't let history go. Fastest way. Guaranteed. Why? It landed side. I know it still hurts. Don't miss out on a good thing. Because you couldn't let go of a bad thing. fastest way to make history repeat itself is when you do not allow it to be history. Five of Swords. It is not good for you to hold on to bad negative energy. Send it packing. Why is the Ace of Pentacles here? Eight of Cups revert. Why? Why Eight of Cups reversed? That's where the choice comes in. Why is the two of swords here? Why is the two of swords here? Why the eight of pentacles?
shadow side. Oh, for the love of paint. Oh, for the love of paint. You have something new and wonderful and abundant coming in. And at the same time, you have something coming back. Hmm. That's a toughie. And it took 35 minutes to figure that out. The shadow side speaks of toxicity. It speaks of negative things. Addiction, obsessive behavior. Things that you are bound to. Best case scenario, something you're heavily bound to. Why the shadow side? You may well be feel like you are bound to it because you put so much energy into it. Chariot reversed, ten of wands reversed. Closing the... It's burdensome. And it's not putting you down the path that you need to be going down. It's obstructing your journey. It's holding you back from jumping. Something is going to come back to obstruct your journey, Sagittarius. And I get it. You probably miss them. They probably missed you, and that's fine. The cycle's over. The worst of it is over. The dawn is coming. Do you want to put yourself back in the darkness? What hurt more, living through it or it ending? What hurt more? You have to ask yourself that. What hurt more? I'm not feeling like this, if this was two different scenarios, I'm not feeling like either one of them was a positive experience. If it was a rerun of the same connection, I don't think it was a positive experience either time. You moved on from it. Keep moving. You're only bound to it if you allow yourself to stay bound to it. Let's get some advice. Six of Wands reversed in the sun. Oh, wow. There's no polite way to say this, so I'm just going to say it. Them not returning is probably better for you. King of Swords and Justice, use your head. Don't make this decision based on emotion. Yes, you have deep feelings for them. 
but you got something better coming in. Don't stop the good stuff from coming in and bringing balance back into your life. Don't do it because you're afraid this is going to happen again. And for those of you who are afraid it's going to happen again, don't let yourself relive it. The only one with the power to stop this is you, Sagittarius. The only one with the power to stop this is you. Lovers reversed and the Nine of Wands. Queen of Swords reversed, Four of Swords reversed. Just because it didn't work out the last time doesn't mean you totally throw in the towel on relationships. And don't let someone else's continuing dishonesty make you restless. Well, if this person lied about this, then this person must be lying about this. No. No. Don't let somebody else's garbage intrude on a new connection. Why would you do that? All right. Wow. 42 minutes. Holy cow. This was a long one. I am so sorry. But I hope it helped somebody. Okay? I love you guys. Be blessed. Thanks for coming by. I got to go do my bread and butter thing here in a little bit. So I will catch you guys later.